Good morning everyone. Today again with Natalia Gretzenko we are going to talk about magnetic products and I am expecting Natalia to join us any moment. In the meantime I would like to remind you about my marathon that's supposed to start this week and I'm delayed in a couple days therefore I have a very good reason and I will tell you about that as soon as you join my marathon. And it is a free marathon. It is um, four weeks of shapes and I will um, uh, tell you more about it or you can just watch m one of my previous uh, videos about it so Natalia is joining me now hello hello Natalia is coming connecting perfect hello I'm just preparing we that's it. awesome <laughs> well, as long as you're preparing, let me start. We are talking today about magnetic uh, gel polishes. And if you guys are uh, not sure about the colors, we have them all and we have more. <laughs> so, um, I just took a picture of my uh, stock and it's not all the gel polishes. And I wanted actually to show you the picture. Mm -hmm. And... How are you, Natalia? We had a chat, that's why I don't even ask, like, how are you doing, but... <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm actually, I'm, I'm fine. I'm fine. It's, it's very hot here, which, mm -hmm. um, honestly to say, I like. I think this is my first summer that I really like uh, when it's hot. <laughs> it's your first summer why. at home. <laughs> Um, yeah, you know, your second, yeah, last, but last time, last year, it was really very uncertain. And uh, yeah, I think that all of us were scared mm -hmm. because we didn't know what to expect. And uh, this time uh, I'm expecting everything good. <laughs> so that's why I feel much better. I feel more positive. <laughs> so Definitely. that's why, yeah. That's the only way. Otherwise, you know, you just can get very easy mad and it's not a good idea at all. It will not sort out with anything. Yeah. And because I also got new products that I'm going to show to you. Mm -hmm. I'm jealous. Um, yeah, but I, I just was a bit lucky. <laughs> I just was a bit lucky because I, I, I saw already that uh, Europe... All people in Europe, all our trainers, they have already these products. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that looks nice. I like it. That's I my... Like you... Sorry, I interrupted you. You go ahead and talk, and I'm just showing uh, some of my products in my stock. I like how you organized it. Well, yeah, that's absolutely cool. Because when people are coming in, I don't have many people coming into my storage because it's my yeah. private storage. Um, but it's still very visible to find and easy to find all the products. Yeah, go ahead. So mm -hmm. Europe got new products. Yes, and I want to show to you. And on the same time, I would like to show to you uh, different ways how we can apply gel polish. Okay. Because with gel polish, uh, like people saying, hey, it's just easy peasy. Yeah, it's really very easy when you're doing this correctly. Otherwise, you will have a chance that your gel polish will be everywhere. And, uh, you know, just uh, we have to know how to apply gel polish perfectly. And for that, we need proper tools as well. Mm -hmm. So unfortunately, we cannot just do it just because we are trying to be careful. But yeah, of course, we have to be careful. So for that, we will need paper palette. Mm -hmm. And we will need uh, several brushes uh, and uh, which one you will use. Actually, I will show to you these brushes that uh, at Magnetic we are recommending to use. And of course, it's up to you which one will, uh, with which one you will feel okay when you are applying the product. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So then uh, let's go. I will turn uh, the screen. As long as you're turning the screen, I will introduce you to the new bottles of Magnetic uh, polishes. So on the beginning, we had uh, just the black bottles, as pretty much everyone um, had them in black. Uh, later on, we started to add to them the actual colors of the bottle, of the polish. So this polish is in the bottle, and this is also on top of the bottle. And then uh, coming new collections, we started to make them even more pretty. So now you have kiwi, and then you have a kiwi and there. If it's a cat eye, we have the name of it, and we have a cat eye on it. 
and they're amazing like these beautiful absolutely beautiful bottles uh, probably Natalia will show you also the new colors they also have a fantastic uh, bottles so it's very visible very easy to see what colors you have uh, in your shelf okay Natalia go ahead yes and I also I like it uh, how, how is about light now is it okay or it was before like this um so far so good no it's better like yes more light is better for me yeah so this is better mm -hmm. okay then i will keep it that way uh so as nadia said that we had very great evolution of our bottles and i really like how uh, they look now and i would say that our uh creative department working really perfectly <laughs> uh to create beautiful bottles so then you just can pick up it very quickly from the shelf mm -hmm. and on the same time for instance if you keep them uh in some uh, somehow in the bottom then you also can put here like little dome drops like these so then you also will see the the, the real color yes we have it and uh, they are silicone and also they are self-adhesive so it means that you easily just can uh, put it on these uh, domes and then uh, seal it with top gel pure and put it on the bottle. So that was originally our bottle. Okay, so I will show to you colors <laughs> because I think that colors are more important. Yeah, like, yeah, like you have. Mm -hmm. So I would say that these colors and these gels, they, are, they look a bit thinner now it's um, blueberry so it's this this summer collection i don't have it yet i'm gonna get it next week yeah. hopefully i hopefully order it next week mm -hmm. so yeah mm -hmm. so it's uh, i would say it's a bit it looks a bit thinner i would say that it will be much easier to apply mm -hmm. but again because uh, it's a gel polish we have to apply it always in two layers so that was then we have blackberry also we, we can see and what i see that it's a real color how you see it on the screen that's so it's beautiful so mm -hmm. beautiful and then we have a uh, peach it's it's ice cream collection mm -hmm. so yeah it's on the same as on screen so they have the same all of them they have the same base so it means that they are highly pigmented and uh, they they are quite thin this is cherry cherry berry also very beautiful color mm -hmm. as you're talking about thin and thick we used to have very thin polishes many years ago then they yes. became slightly thicker yes um, and then and then very thick and, and, now <laughs> and now it's back to a bit thinner because formula is changing all time you know this mm -hmm. uh, i would say that it's the it's the same as on screen what i see yeah, um, mm -hmm. they, they look absolutely gorgeous and pistachio and i already said to myself that seems that it will be my favorite color Mm. everybody's asking for it i mixed it so often it's crazy it's also yes. um, similar to the cool water but it's a little bit more pastel right it's more pastel yes, yes. and, and through the thickness absolutely. it's so much easier to apply and to cure mm -hmm. because those polishes back then and i still use it because i have uh, clients who really love that are still wanting yeah. uh, that color mm -hmm. so and now let's apply it so and i will use this color oh. if you don't mind mm -hmm. i don't mind at all it's very beautiful unfortunately i cannot make it bigger so then i just will so that's the color mm -hmm. and first of all the first rule everything that you see in the bottle shake it before using mm -hmm. every time i already made prepared a tip you see mm -hmm. that that's what i was filing so shake it and if it's a winter time it's best way to shake it between your palms so then um, you will have good consistency of your product so it warms up a little bit but be always careful that you actually have closed bottles because 
uh, I had that accident happening to me. Bottle mm -hmm. wasn't close, and I tied it to it, and I was, whoa! Oh, yeah. yeah. Nice. <laughs> so there are many ways how we can apply it in a nice way, because, you know, uh, nicely it looks if it's um, the gel polish placed as close to the cuticle as possible. Mm -hmm. That's actually the main idea. So, and for the easiest way to do it, when we are using, not this one, wait a second, when we are using our triangle brush. Oh, just a minute, my cat came here and I think that, I hope that she will go away. Because she's jumping over TV set and I'm always afraid that she will damage something. <laughs> and I have, <laughs> yeah, because they already ripped off all wa wallpaper. And I have uh, two of them. One is for red colors and one is for white colors. Okay, just a second. I will remove you. Okay, perfect. So in the meantime, I will uh, show you some colors. Uh, the latest colors we have got in Canada are the these four, which is a pineapple, watermelon, kiwi, and grapefruit. Very beautiful, very mm, rich, uh, neon but pastel neon colors and uh, we have got six of the new transparent colors we were talking about uh, with natalia a couple weeks ago okay you're back mm -hmm. yes so uh, the best way to apply it using this triangle brush and mm -hmm. i will show to you i'm use i will use white because it's already high to uh, have white pigment inside and because this color also pastel, so it means that I can use this brush. Normally, of course, we have to prepare everything. We have to clean it. I will clean it with prep and wipe, just to be sure that I will have good application. I will give you the code in a second, Anna Maria. Find. And when you're cleaning, also be sure, fold it like that, and then also clean nicely in side walls and in the aponychium area. We have to be sure that we have no dust. <clears throat> so when it's prepared, just take a little bit of the product from the paper palette because what I'm going to do now, I just will apply it as close to cuticle as possible. And because this brush has longer here, I have as the chance to go as close to the side wall as possible. And you see that the first layer I'm applying, it's almost like semi-transparent and I need it because now I'm creating like a border and then my next layer will not get over this border. I did it many times and I did it with many brushes, but I would say that this triangle brush is the best one for this job. I think uh, I'm showing in the camera the product number. I think it's backwards. So it's 1760. Eight six, the rhinestone triangle brush. Uh, if you're putting in the search triangle brush, you will find it. Mm -hmm. So I did it as well with, yeah, of course you can do it with uh, flower brush, but still because flower brush has a bit shorter here and it will be complicated for you to get into the product, uh, into the, the fold. Now I have to cure it for 10 seconds and I will do it using Tara Tom. Mm. Can you hold yes. everything a little bit more uh, toward, like up? Or like not in the, Is like, it? Yeah, like not, not only closer to the camera, but also higher because uh, you're hiding behind the comments. Yeah, perfect. Thank you. That's awesome. Thank you, Nadia. Nadia said also uh, the product number as I was looking for it. Mm -hmm. So 10 seconds, just enough because it's very thin layer. And as I said, that we need this layer 
just like a border layer. So it's a guideline basically for the next layer. So it's not running exactly. out. It's, mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then when I will apply product from the bottle, it I will keep my finger slightly down, obviously. And then I have a chance to close again, go, go to close, close to the cuticle. But because I applied already my very first layer, So you see that it's not moving anywhere. Mm -hmm. And it's done. And you see how good pigmentation is. That's amazing. So beautiful. Yeah. yeah, you still can apply second layer. Before I was correcting this using this brush. And actually I found for myself it's a bit complicated because once you are moving big amount of the product, you have a chance that it will run to the cuticle. Mm -hmm. When in this case, this is just like it is. Okay, I will cure it again. So, and you see that we have to keep everything evenly in our lump. Otherwise, our gel can cure only for one side. Mm -hmm. Nadia is saying that the triangle brush takes gel polish manicure to a new level. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. yeah. And you see that it's very thin application. Nail does not look bulky, mm -hmm. and it looks absolutely good. But still, it's still possible to apply second layer. Let's. I, I would say that I, I was happy already with first layer. Mm -hmm. Because uh, product really highly pigmented. You know, just to be sure, I will apply second one. But as I said, that I was absolutely happy with first layer. Come just with one. Hi, Magda. Yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, beautiful color. It's amazing, yeah. Mm -hmm. So but what is the name of this color? Sorry. It's, it's pistachio. Pistachio. Mm -hmm. Yes, but I would say that I don't see such a huge difference, but still, uh, you know, always sometimes we can have like little bump here. Mm -hmm. What we can do to remove it with brush pen, just pull it towards yourself before going to UV lamp. Mm -hmm. And then you will have absolutely perfect application. So when I'm working or making nails for picture, I always do it. So just, you know, you see that, that I'm pulling just from the very, very end. Mm -hmm. But then I don't have this bump on the end of the nail and everything looks absolutely smooth. Okay, so then I will cure this one. I love this little torch. <laughs> mm -hmm. Silicone. Yeah, especially with this uh, silicone finger, it's so much easier because you're holding it as you need it. And it's not mm -hmm. uh, rolling in, in the lamp or something. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. So, and then, yeah, I will seal it uh, with matte top coat. I think that with matte top coat, you know, mm. this, this is just made for matte top coat. I also had a question. Recently, I had a course. Uh, for uh, ladies from Syria and they ask me that sometimes uh, gel polish when you're applying this it has like little spots the why it happening it happening because you did not shake your bottle before using mm -hmm. so always shake the bottle before using I think I know it's never had it with magnetic even though I'm like I'm not always shaking so I, I'm guilty <laughs> Yeah, sometimes I just grab it and work with it. I never had a problem with the spots or something. Yeah, uh, just recently I had this experience with, um, not with base and top, uh, with the... Mm -hmm, oh, with the top coat. Top gel. Yes, yeah, with the top, top yes. Ah, yeah. Uh, yeah. I, I, didn't, I thought of yeah. you talking about gels. Yeah, no, no. A uh, top no, coat, absolutely, no, no. you need to shake coat. that. Especially yes, the ones no. that have a UV filter in them. Yeah. And now look wow it's so beautiful well wet 
appearing. Well, Christina is asking, what is the website to order the triangle brush? Christina, if you are in USA or Canada, you can order it from nadiabeauty.com. I will show you. Um, how can I show you? Okay. It's like this, Nadia, my first name, beauty.com. So it's probably backwards, but you can see nadiabeauty.com. If you are in Canada or USA, and if you are not here, then tell me what country you are in, and I will tell you where to order it. Or one of our so distributors will contact you. Mm -hmm. So and, and you see that with this beautiful brush, because it has longer hair, you can go, as I said, as close to the cuticle as possible, and then you can have perfect gel polish application. Very thin, not bulky, just beautiful and expensive. <laughs> that is so mad. I love it. The girls say, <laughs> oh, thank you, Magda. Magda just posted uh, my website down uh, below. Christina is from USA. So I would be your person to talk to. You can also private message me if you have any questions. Um, so matte top coat. I absolutely love matte top coat. You remember last mm -hmm. week we were doing this nail. I'm still wearing it. And then I did yeah. my nails very quickly. They're not perfectly made, unfortunately. Um, and we put the pearl coat and then the matte on top of them. So yes. they look very, after a week now, they're still looking very velvet. Velvet, yeah. Do like you have this silky velvet. velvet. Yes, you have very nice this velour effect. And also, as you noticed, that if we put it into UV, it's not shining in UV uh, light. Mm -hmm. It's not shining the same as, um, um, as uh, other top gels that have UV filters. But still, this top gel also has perfect UV filters that protecting color as it is till the next refill. Oh, so, so they have yes. UV filters. Yes, it has UV filters, but it's mm -hmm. not like usual UV filters. That's what I wanted okay. to say. Okay. So uh, it, uh, this color will, will remain till the next refill. But still sometimes, you know, because of the makeup or something, you still can have like little stains. So then just with brush, just clean it with soap and that's it. Mm -hmm. It's very easy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we women clean our hands a lot doing making dinners and <laughs> dishes and stuff. So yes, yeah. Anyway, yeah. So pistachio we already did. Now I will I will show to you this cherry color. I can't wait to get them. I'm so mm -hmm. jealous. Yeah, you will get them very soon. You will get them soon. So you see, one layer is absolutely perfect product is thin and also highly pigmented i can imagine just, how good they are for the gel uh, for the um, nail art like even painting with them because they're so thin and highly pigmented it's super mm -hmm. easy to cover it on one layer you don't even go with the second if you're drawing something right yeah so that's i will cure it quickly you know just like for a couple of seconds and then again with matte. All pastel colors, they are specially made for matte top coat. I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> you are not. <laughs> they kidding, actually look richer, like more, more expensive. Yes. If they have yes. a matte top coat and not shiny. Uh-huh, exactly. That, that's what I mean, that they are specially made. Of course, mm -hmm. they are not. But uh, the effect that they have absolutely amazing. Extreme matte top gel. Excuse me for interrupting. One o four zero zero two. The product number. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. So you see how quickly it's already cured. Yeah. But still, we, uh, yeah, it's better to cure it for full time of curing one and a half minute. This is just like flash curing. What I'm doing now. Mm -hmm. So it was cherry, mm. cherry berry, yes. That's mm -hmm. gorgeous. So then next one I will show to you. It will be blackberry. By the way, also very beautiful color. Shake product well before started using. 
So you see that it's very thin and very highly pigmented. Dun, dun, dun. Even on the easy trainer that I did before, I applied two layers, but I would say that it's just enough one layer. Mm -hmm. But again, if you see that you are not completely happy with color, of course, it's better to apply it with two thin layers. Don't try to apply it with thick layer just, just once. It will not work this way. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> so uh, you notice that I keep my bottle and I'm using, uh, and I have this product and I'm using the light. But you see that uh, light will cure only product that um, just going into the light. So it means that everything that in 90 degrees going to the light will get cured. Mm -hmm. So that's why, but still it's better to be safe than sorry because I know what I'm doing. So that's why I'm acting very brave. Mm -hmm. But if you are curing something, it's better to remove all light sensitive product from your table or at least from out of your lamp then you will not have a um, not nice surprise look wow 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 so i will not uh, make all of them i just will show to them to you one more time because i would say that you know all these colors they are so cool that that it's better to have just the whole collection because you also you can easy can mix it and make ombre out of that mm. and it looks yeah. absolutely gorgeous but yeah because you can mix it because both of them they have white pigment then you will not have any problem with absolutely. ombre effect yes we should and, make an uh, ombre video yes let's make it by the way let's make it next time <laughs> yeah, all kind of ombres with this, with this, yes. with a, with a ding, 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 with a boom, 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 and with a blum, blum, blum. We can do all yes. these types. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let let's do it. Yeah. So this this collection six colors, and I would say that it's better to to have all of them because I, I I don't know which one I would skip honestly to say because all of them they are different and you easily can mix them all together, making very nice ombre. And on the meantime, I would like to <clears throat> introduce to you our another collection. It's makeup collection. Mm -hmm. Uh, Magda said uh, they're brilliant for ombre. Uh, they are all blending perfectly. Oh, yes, this yeah. is also the new collection I haven't got yet. Oh, I would say so it's nice. a business collection. So this is a summer crazy collection. Yeah, let's get wild. <laughs> but and still this very is, beautiful. <laughs> and this is let's get to business. <laughs> okay. So that color is also absolutely amazing. I would like to show to you. Love and the they have again. they have the same uh, consistency, mm -hmm. so also highly pigmented. So and you easily can see that it's very highly pigmented and very thin. So it's just this one. It's a peach cream. So this one is rose cream. And again, beautiful bottles. Yes. And again, I would say it's for business women. Pink cream. Wow. Very it's like very, yeah, very pastel, ashy, warm pink. And it's dark. Also beautiful. Mm. I have uh, so such, um, how to say it, lipstick. Mm. <laughs> yes. And because they also contain white pigment, because they are um, mm, yeah, pastel colors, they are also specially, specially made <laughs> <laughs> for matte top coat. <laughs> they, of course, can okay. be used with any other color. <laughs> Of course, they can be used for any other color. Yeah, I just will use this. I don't know which one even I like more. I like all of them, you know. Mm -hmm. So this one will be pink cream. And again, we can use them. Look, pam, pam, and it's done. 
it's like okay. very nude yes very nude very nice very thin your nail never will look bulky mm -hmm. it will look smooth as nature made them beautiful and it's also very nice for french so let's cure it la, la, la. Well, my torch still doesn't have a lump, uh, um, battery in that. But batteries, yeah. <laughs> yeah, first what I got, I got uh, two um, sets of batteries. But I would say that, you know, it's, it does not take so much energy. Mm -hmm. So, and it's uh, working quite nicely. Beautiful. That's beautiful. and cure again so and you see that on the a place where light is coming with 90 degrees on that place we will have curing process it's very important to keep uh, our nail in the full light mm -hmm. i mean that light has to go everywhere on the nail then we will have proper curing process look how cool it is it's amazing Mm hmm absolutely and and i left it as a dessert mm, may's choice this year yes. again red <laughs> beautiful uh, i and it's it's absolutely it's so cool red <laughs> this this red just i would say it's queen of reds mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. look at this Param and it's done. Oh. Because usually, um, yeah, red color is not easiest color. Did you know that? Uh, yes. <laughs> it's not easier to apply it and it's not easiest to make it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because, uh, yeah, you have to be really very understand what you are doing when you are making this color. Look, one layer. Thin, perfect. beautiful shade matching to my lips my lips right now don't look like that but i have a <laughs> lipstick like that so uh yeah i should get that is it yes. still a thing at all that the nails should match i mean the nails never match toes in my case at least <laughs> but the uh, nails and lips is or is it now no go absolutely tell us please tell us uh, i i would say that you know I'm wearing not only two different hands, but also different nails. So to me, um, I would say that it does not matter. But some people, for them, this is important. You know, mm -hmm. actually, it depends. <laughs> Magda says, nah. <laughs> <laughs> it depends. Because for toenails, I still, I would prefer to use nail polishes. Because it's easy to remove and it's easy to apply. And nail polish that Magnetic has, this NXT series here, is mm -hmm. absolutely amazing. So I made it also with matte. Because with shiny, we know that it will look gorgeous. And now let's check it, how it will look with matte. What top coat would you use on top of the red, um, so not to get the blue? Uh, basin top. Or uh, matte top coat. Hmm. So if you want to have it shiny, you would put base on top, but then base you... Base and top. You might uh, get the discoloration, so... Uh, no, with, with base and top, uh, because, you know, usually, if you want to remove these UV things, uh, normally, like, uh, if you're a ceiling, like, over the black color mm -hmm. or red color, so then you don't want to have this bluish effect. So that's why over the black... Um, blue uh, green or red colors pure red color then it's better to use a uh, base and top every color that has white pigment including pastel colors they must be protected with uv filters mm -hmm. okay. but as i said that uh, matte top coat will not shine so much so and you see how 
gorgeous yeah, and expensive it's with mud. As I said that uh, they are specially made for mud top coat. <laughs> <laughs> That's so gorgeous. Well, yes. Uh, if um, you don't mind, I would show a couple more collections that we had so people can yes. understand. If you don't, you're not uh, familiar with magnetic uh, products, we have different gel polishes in different... Oh, the triangle brush, of course. Let me turn this around. <laughs> so we had, of course, uh, two gorgeous collections of the glass gels. So they are transparent gels, again, in the very beautiful bottles. Mm -hmm. And we had quite a few videos about them so they're actually absolutely transparent so they yes. have a color but they're absolutely transparent you can put anything underneath of them you can put even glitter underneath and it, they look just gorgeous we mm -hmm. also had a collection with, uh, for the seduction um, manicure line they're slightly transparent also very beautiful bottles again and the idea was to make it slightly semi-transparent. Yeah, so they look very natural. They can um, uh, replicate your um, skin um, and nail shade. So, um, not, not shade, yeah, shade basically. So you don't really see them on the nails or you can slightly change that, right? And I applied it here pretty like, thick so you can actually see the shade. But they're and very, bottles. very beautiful. Look, look at that bottles. They're so pretty. Aren't they gorgeous? Look. Yes. And they can also go underneath or on top of uh, different designs. Mm -hmm. Then we had, of course, our collection that I have to show in the bot, in <laughs> the packages. <laughs> this one is absolutely, oh, gypsy gorgeous. But I <laughs> love it. <laughs> so yes. This is a bald mask, right? So masquerade. Yes. So we have, we also had a video with the colors. Those are most pigmented uh, gel, uh, glitter gel polishes for me. So in every, uh, pretty much every I will every show shade. it. Yes, it's, it's absolutely, Nadia, absolutely right. It's the most glitter product that actually you can get. Yeah, I have to uh, shake it well because yeah. it was... I would say the Isabella is the most going for me. Yeah, actually. I, I have. Yeah, it's, I, uh, I love Pucci Puccinella. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but you can see, like, they they yes. are absolutely solid glitters in one coat. Mm -hmm. And the polish itself is a little bit um, colored, so it's not completely transparent. So the the liquid that connects the glitter particles has a little bit of shade so that you don't have any bold spots uh, on the nail. Mm -hmm. And the next two collections we have got are, of course, our and cat eye And I used, I used it in this nail. Oh, the glitter one. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I've seen, I've seen your demo. Yes, and, and, I would... and this one with cat, yeah, and also I used here cat eye as well. Oh, oh. <laughs> beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Let me show the cat eye, and be, because we have yes. different cat eyes. We had the first collection that is just beautiful collection, mm -hmm. and then we have absolutely stunning, even more beautiful, beautiful. collection. <laughs> even more beautiful. I don't know if you can see that shimmer. Like, this is the most beautiful colors in mm -hmm. uh, uh, cat eye collection. So Star Sapphire is absolutely a, run, a, re, a runner, runner? Um, I will show you on the... Winner. Winner, yeah. I will show yeah. you on the clear tip. You actually, it looks better on the black, but mm -hmm. you can actually see the actual color of it if I'm... Uh, so you can already see the shimmer here. I don't know yes, what I'm and, doing. And you, you can leave it how it is or... Mm -hmm you can use your magnet to mm -hmm. make it even more interesting yeah so you apply one coat uh, if you really want it very um, extreme you would put it on top of the black right mm -hmm. but here it is just as it is let me put some 
light to and it again helps. it's it's specially made for matte top coat <laughs> <laughs> so with matte top coat it also will look absolutely amazing and you can use either straight or round magnet mm -hmm. to create to make different effects absolutely look at this mm -hmm. Go gorgeous you can play with it as you like and the darker area has now that shimmer yes so I love it. it it is a galaxy manicure in a second yes mm -hmm. in, in four true. different colors so this is absolutely my lib uh, Lieblings. <laughs> Lieblings is German. Sorry, <laughs> my favorite product. Favorite, yes. <laughs> I guess I, I needed some sleep. And did I miss any other special collections? I mean, every collection is special on its own. Every collection is special. I just wanted um, to um, share with you my, uh, you know, that I also got these beautiful fashion stickers. You know that I love, I love stickers. And uh, these self-adhesive stickers, they are the best, as I have shown to you that I use this gold one already here. I just had so it here just somewhere. On the, mm -hmm. on the top, and you see that it's very thin, mm -hmm. so you don't feel it like it's something. They are really absolutely thin, these stickers, and we have them as, uh, yeah, that definitely must have. <laughs> because i have them already them. in gold you can already order them in gold and silver yes. is coming yes Sil silver is they are completely new ones i have gold one and i totally fall in love with them when mm -hmm. i saw that we have it in silver i decided i must have it and i also want to show to you sexy pexy <gasps> oh my god yes <sighs> they are i love this packaging i would say this packaging is just gorgeous so we have like uh, just to to see clearly what uh, pattern you are going to get so then we can see this printed on the back side that's sex yeah. on the nails basically so yes sex on the nails <laughs> and also uh boho style and uh sweet life with specially made for our ice cream collection <laughs> sweet life didn't i get it already i don't i don't remember i i just saw it and no it, it's it it's it's new one. Oh, cupcake no i haven't got that yeah mm -hmm. i don't it's have completely it. new one yes so then you also i, I saw that henrietta already was using and she was filling up this pattern uh, mm -hmm. with this gel polish and it looked absolutely gorgeous and i was thinking i definitely must try it and I also want to show to you something else, something completely else. It's uh, the frosted pink. Well, Nadia, this color. It's also like ice cream. just look at that color. Look Very at this beautiful. color. Absolutely. I know many American nail techs love this color. Absolutely love the pink mm -hmm. nude color so the pink camouflage basically so yes it is amazing it is amazing on its own so you can build the whole nail out of it or you mm -hmm. can use it for your french and yes and don't don't forget that if you are using uh, these tubes it's better to keep them upside down not like this one but that way because then you mm -hmm. can open your uh, tube with no problem and you can get mm -hmm. your product without having the remains of the product in the lid. Mm -hmm. And of course, we have them in the jar and in the tube. And so you don't yes. have to get the tube if you don't like the tubes. Yep. Uh, and power gel. What is power gel? We had another video. It is not acrylic gel. It is not nope. uh, poly gel. It is gel. It is oligomer. It's, it's very gel. special made for us oligomer. And um, it's pretty unique so far as I know. So yes, please um, try it. <laughs> you definitely will fall in love with this because this product is uh, very flexible. On the same time, it's uh, keep very good shape, so you can pinch it. It's very light in wearing. It's very easy to file. It's almost like non-filing. And if you have to file, then this is just a and filing is done. So I would say it's the best product I ever tried. Magda is saying this color is just wow. Yes. yes, absolutely. Wow. <laughs> I know North American nail techs love this pink. And I will also get that soon. And I will probably put the products uh, within a week uh, for pre-order. So if you would like to get something 
just pre-order it and as soon as it gets in you will be the first one to get them to make sure you don't miss them girls i highly recommend you pre-order it because then you will get it and you will not be disappointed at all i can guarantee it absolutely it will, gorgeous it will be your best and investment ever <laughs> that's awesome okay. well thank you very much natalia for uh joining us today as always uh next week uh we will ch we have to check the day and time we're gonna be live uh if it's gonna yeah, be but... wednesday or thursday we can do it wednesday or thursday so anytime we can do it wednesday and thursday <laughs> okay so and let's make ombre next time yes so we will do the you will use the brush because you are pretty good at it already i'm, I'm not and more. you will use air nails i i knew it that you are going to use air nails yes because the easiest way to make ombre is uh, air nails the most quickest and easiest way no yes no not for yes. me i have I'll, I'll show you okay i'll show you my problem is uh, as people know me i'm like getting into something and then i'm like ah pff, oh. i have a box here yeah full of air nail products i have three guns in here okay i have two um two machines one of them is from katerina okay the compressors i have stickers here i have a cleaning jar in here and the guns don't work. Um, okay. And what my problem what? is uh, very easy. I need to replace the um, needle, and I have a new needle. I just have to sit down and do it. <laughs> and God, I was thinking there is a huge problem. <laughs> there is this actually is a just, huge problem because I took them apart and put them back. Needle, it's nothing. <laughs> My clients wait for me to get that fix, and that's standing there forever. And I'm like, ah, oh, not really. And I need some fresh paint, I guess, because my paint is also a little bit dry. Uh, yucky. <laughs> yeah, you know when you don't close. Okay, your out, out of right. date. Out of date. Yeah. <laughs> so, sometimes yeah. Anyways, uh, if I manage to do, to fix it for next week, I will show you air nails. If I don't manage to fix it, I will just show then you. Then we will video. do air. Then we will do air nails next time. Uh, <laughs> no, I, but I will also use this one. <laughs> okay. Okay. So then you will do it with a sponge, and I will do ombre with a brush. Yes, and if I fix the air nails, I'll show you the air nails. And if not, I actually have an online video on YouTube how I did ombre with airbrush. I did it once. <laughs> I did it once. On the video, I did it I did a couple it times on the client. <laughs> I'm so guilty. <laughs> Katerina will kill me because uh, she taught me no, like one on one okay. the air nails, and uh, I had one personal <laughs> lesson with Katerina Goncher. And if you guys want an online course on uh, air nails, let me know and we will figure out something. Yeah, air nails, the most quickest way uh, to make design. This is the first uh, stage for me. Second stage is stickers and third stage is uh, stand, uh, is stand, uh, run stamping. Stamp. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so yeah, it was a fun. Code for frosted pink power gel tube oh thank you magda 104233 finally we have the same product numbers as you guys in uh, europe yeah. because we had different packaging for Before, europe and outside yes. of europe and so i have gel polishes with mixed up numbers it's just it's a disaster so now everything is the same for everyone because it's all complicated thank you very much for watching we'll see you next thank week thank you and see you next week subscribe to our youtube channels follow us on every social media you find yes. us <laughs> and um we'll see you we and see pray. you next week bye thank bye. you for watching thank you thank you thank magda you. for bye. helping thank you <laughs>